Okay, what if you need to turn a decimal into a fraction? Now you may know what the fraction is for 0.25, but the method for figuring it out is the same. So let's see if we can figure it out. Um, you need to find the place value for the last number in the decimal. So this place value, the 5 is sitting in the hundredths place. So that means that I've put 25 on the top of the fraction and 100 on the bottom because it's sitting in the hundredths place. And then I simplify the fraction. I'm looking for a number that I can divide evenly into both 25 and 100. So 5 goes into both 25 and 100. So 25 divided by 5 equals 5. And 20, or 100 divided by 5, you can think of that as how many nickels in a dollar. There are 20. And it looks like I can do that again. 5 divided by 5 is 1. And 20 divided by 5 is 4. So that means that 0.25 equals 1 fourth.